Hey, what's up, what's up? Welcome to ToddFalcone.com. I had, uh, I kind of pounded an issue the other night. So I did uh, Monday night, this past Monday. Well, it depends on when you're watching this video. I did a live dialing session and the live dialing session was me prospecting live and having people listen to what I was doing while I was doing it. Uh, because we did a kind of last minute, me coming back from my river property and being with my chainsaw for a few days, uh, we didn't do it with any kind of visuals or anything like that. And I was explaining something because during the uh, the live dials, I was, I was making these phone calls within the Fearless Networker system. This is something that you're going to hear if you haven't heard about, you're going to hear a lot more about as we move through the rest of this year into the, the next year and, and so on. And it's all about helping you to be more organized. Uh, I have too many coaching clients and people that I work with that I see letting things slip through the cracks, not being on their follow-up routine or their follow-up game, uh, using archaic methods to stay on top of their follow-up routine, if you will, uh, and just n not really as, um, I don't know, on top of their entire prospecting game as they could be. So we spent a number of months uh, putting together this system. It's called the Fearless Networker System. You'll see it in this post. Uh, I would really encourage you to take it for a test drive and not only take it for a test drive, but really start using this in your day-to-day -day prospect prospecting efforts. A couple things, for example, like the other night, uh, this is, this is one of the, even if it just, even if I didn't go to any more details than this, this is, this is power in your fingertips. So I am making calls the other night. Here's, here's a few examples of how much more organized and on top of your prospecting game you can be when you use the Fearless Networker system. Number one, for example, I'm making phone calls uh, on Monday night. I get uh, a voicemail, and the voicemail box is, it's full, which we get occasionally. People, they don't, they don't delete their voicemails, and, and here I go call this guy, I can't even leave him a message. Well, I can literally, within the system, I can push a single button, and it goes out and sends him an email, says, hey, John, hey, I just left you a voicemail, or tried to leave you a voicemail message, couldn't reach you, so I was still able to make an impression even though I was unable to reach that person. Or I left a message for a person and I also backed it up by clicking a single button in the system and I said, hey, Joanna, Todd Falcone, listen, I just left you a voicemail message. Figured I'd drop you a quick email as well. Give me a call, here's my direct cell phone number, let's connect. So I'm, I'm able to make additional impressions. Now the other thing is, as I was making those phone calls, and I'm not gonna reach and get off camera right now, although I should have planned for it, my on my mobile phone, because we have a, a mobile app with the Fearless Networker system. It's shooting me push notifications. It says, hey, Sandra Smith, just opened up your email. You know, John, whatever, opened up your email. Somebody who I had called and wasn't able to leave a message or somebody I was able to call and I left a message, I'm seeing the fact that they're opening up the emails. I'm seeing the fact, oh, he clicked on the link in the email. By the way, this is the ultimate power for me, okay, and for you. When you send something, someone, something, whatever that is, let's say you're directing someone to a 10 minute video and in the 10 minute video, it lays out who your company is, which is kind of standard fare, not necessarily saying 10 minutes, but video. Well, most of you do not know how much or little they watched. Well, one of the coolest things is when I send out an email to my prospect, I know when they clicked on the email because it sends me a push notification to my phone. So if I'm out cruising around with the wife and I get this push notification that said, John Smith, just open up your email. Cool. He got my email. He opened it up. Oh, John Smith just finished watching your video. It's going to tell me that John Smith watched two minutes, 15 seconds, or all 10 minutes of it. So I know that John Smith watched all of the video, none of the video, or a little bit of the video. So, you know, when I called John Smith back, like literally, and how cool is this? Because I just got a notification that said, hey, John Smith just finished watching your entire video. I can pick up the phone and call John Smith. Hey, John Todd Falcone just noticed that you had a chance to watch the video. Oh my gosh, how did you know that? Like, are you watching me? No, I mean, you just, it's just technology, but it's very cool technology and it puts the power in your fingertips. When's the best time to call back a prospect? Right after they looked at the information. 
if you haven't looked at this, uh, I would encourage you to do so. It's a very cool piece of technology. That's the tip of the iceberg. There's so many other things that it does. I'm not even going to, I don't know, maybe in my post down below this video, I'll talk about a few of the things that are part of the Fearless Networker system, but you owe it to yourself to put the control in your own fingertips when it comes to your follow-up, your prospecting efforts. Uh, it's just, it's, it's truly amazing. So check it out, and uh, that's it. We'll see you on a... Another video, stay fearless. Appreciate you watching.